A long-awaited plan to make over Cleveland's lakefront is now in the hands of the city council. The mayor's proposal was presented to the council tonight. Some big questions now. Is it enough and who will pay for it? Our Lydia Espara has details and reaction. Tonight, Cleveland City Council introduced legislation for a tax increment financing program, or TIF. Establishing the shore-to-core-to-shore -to -shore TIF district, de declaring improvements to certain parcels of real property within that district to, to be a public purpose and exempt from taxation. A shore-to-core-to-shore -to -shore plan by Mayor Justin Bibb to divert a portion of future increases in property taxes to pay for public infrastructure downtown on waterfronts. The monies will also come from federal and state funding with the intent to provide the local match. The creation of the nonprofit North Coast Waterfront Development Corporation would allow philanthropic donations towards the master plan. It's thinking big. It's thinking big so that, that we are giving ourselves a huge new tool. A new tool indeed. Imagine five public squares. That's how big the shorter core will be. It will include a 22-acre site stretching from Burke Lakefront Airport to the Port of Cleveland. The plan refers to it as the front porch of Cleveland. I think it's important for Clevelanders to remember that downtown in our waterfronts, it's the front door for how our region presents to the world. Based on residential surveys, we could see 60% lakeside dining, 58% festivals, 50% of arts and cultural events, and 48% Sandy Beach. Policy Matters Ohio doesn't see the plan as a win-win for Cleveland. Key businesses like Cuyahoga Community College, Cleveland Metro Parks, the Cleveland Public Library, and the Health and Human Services agencies could lose. As proposed, uh, this plan is going to take revenue from key services that the voters have approved. Now, this is a 20 to 30 year vision plan for the city, but construction is set to start within the next two years and complete it, Russ, the next 10. So we'll see. Sounds exciting, but the controversy clearly continues. Yep. All right, Lydia, thank you so much.